How were you difficult in the old days? Did you do marvellous difficult things? Which area do you want to get into? <laughs> I'm Satya Delamonte too. For decades, I was Dennis Hopper's right-hand man, a.k.a. El Hombre Indivisible. Dennis affected world culture. The star, the writer, the director, everything he could be, he was, and he is. In the 70s, we were partying. Dennis was regarded as a notorious disruptor in Hollywood. Ah, script, man. Just a blueprint. God, look what you did, Dennis. <laughs> He'd been blacklisted. He went into a downward spiral at that point. I had to make a decision whether I was going to keep getting drunk at parties or whether I was going to make a movie. And then came Dennis Hopper, who did not know his lines, but was right on and damn good at it. Dennis and David Lynch, how would you characterize the way they worked together? Famously. He was absolutely perfect. He was he's so ingrained into the world of art. You could take this guy to Harvard and give a lecture, right? The crazy man of Hollywood. <laughs>